Hey ladies, this one today is for you. Are you suffering with painful periods and menstrual cramps? Well, in today's video, I'm gonna share with you some very easy natural ways to help stop your period pain and menstrual cramps. Hey everyone, this is Stephanie from Fast Track to Health Wellness Center. Welcome to the channel. I'm going to get right into it. Now, this is very near and dear to me because I personally have suffered from cramps for a really long time in my life. At this moment now, being the age that I am, I've gotten a really good handle on it, but it took me quite a few years to figure this out. So in any case, I used to have to stay home from school because I was in so much pain. I would miss a couple of days of school because of that, it was horrible. So in any case, the older I got, and then I got into the natural health field, totally learned how to change my diet and add in certain supplements and herbs and now I have no period pain, so it's awesome. So in any case, let's get right into it. So the first thing I wanna tell you about is look into what you're eating, especially around your period. So there are certain things that are gonna make the period pain worse. The normal bad things that I always talk about in my videos, like too much sugar and even caffeine. If you're having a lot of caffeine around your cycle, that can interfere as well. And then even dairy products. So even if you're not sensitive to dairy, it can contribute to your period pain. So you may want to reduce or take out dairy at least around your cycle now another thing that you may not have thought of and this is a Chinese medicine principle is you want to avoid cold and raw foods especially around your cycle so things like salads and smoothies just have warm cooked food around the time of your period because in Chinese medicine when things are cold things stiffen up within the body and that can cause pain and contractions and cramping so avoid cold and raw now I'm gonna get into to some supplements and vitamins and herbs that are also really good for period pain, okay? So the first one I wanna get into is minerals. Now, we all have nutrient deficiencies in general, but a lot of us are really low in minerals. The main mineral that we use is calcium and mag with magnesium. So the supplement that we actually have has five parts calcium to one part magnesium. Usually magnesium is the one that's always talked about, but calcium is also extremely important in any type of cramp in the body not just menstrual cramps, but any type of cramp, leg cramps, whatever. So we use a product called Calcium Lactate from Standard Process. It's very easily absorbed. It's best taken without food. It's very good for the tissue calcium. Calcium is used in different ways throughout the body, but in this case, it's gonna be needed in the tissue to relieve the cramps. So we use Calcium Lactate from Standard Process, which has some magnesium in it. Next, this is an easy one. You could go to the store and get this red raspberry leaf tea. That's available almost everywhere. That is really excellent for the spasms and the cramping in the uterine tissue. So that's a really easy one. Now the next couple remedies I'm gonna tell you are from a company called Mediherb. And this is the company that we use for our herbal supplements. So there's three formulas that we specifically use to help regulate the cycle, PMS, and for cramps. So the first one is very efficient for cramps. It's called Cramplex, so that makes sense. So there's five different herbs in there. It's Cordalis, Cramp Bark, Red Raspberry Leaf, as you just heard before, ginger and wild yam. So this is an excellent formula and it's especially good to take like three or four days prior to your cycle and during your cycle to help with the cramps and the spasms. Okay, next is a product called Femco. This is also good for regulating the cycle. This is good for PCOS. This is good for blood sugar issues for liver. Femco contains schisandra, which is great for the liver, white peony, which is great for blood sugar, and shatavari, which is an Ayurvedic herb. So last but not least, and this is uh, an herb that I've been taking for a very long time it's really helped regulate my periods it's called chase tree I really love this formula as it helps the body produce its own estrogen it doesn't give you estrogen there's no hormones in it but it helps the endogenous production of progesterone in your body which can help balance the estrogen because having an estrogen imbalance is part of the reason why you have period problems in the first place so chase tree is something I highly recommend as well so I hope these tips were helpful for you ladies I'm gonna link below to these products so you can find out more about them. If you have any questions or comments, please let me know below. And if you'd like to get our help for a personalized protocol for yourself, because everybody is different, we offer free consultation. So please see the link below and get in touch. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching and please subscribe and share. Take care. Bye.